Hey Dry So Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw a playground, so let's get started. To draw this awesome playground, let's first start by drawing a big triangle for the roof. So I'm going to come right here, give myself a point, and that's my center. And I'm going to come down with an angle on both sides. So a nice big triangle, and I'm just going to go ahead and connect it. Then from there, I'm going to bring down two posts. So straight line down right here to say about that much. And then I'm going to thicken it up and connect. So same thing on the other side, but right here. And definitely turn your paper if you need to. Whatever helps for you to draw these lines. Okay, so I have my two posts in. Then let's come to say about this area right here and I'm going to draw a line across. And now for some details, I'm gonna bring a big opening right here. So I'm gonna go up, big curve, and then down. And then I'll add a ladder right here. So I'm going to come to this door area, come out with an angle, and same thing over here to create my ladder. Then, once again, I'm going to thicken this up. So Jossa Cuties, remember this is just to inspire you and give you some ideas. Uh, you can draw your playground however you like, of course, right? So I'll come to say about right here, I'm just gonna start drawing some lines across for our ladder. And one more down here. There. Okay, so now that we have that in, I thought maybe we could add some uh, openings in here. Heart-shaped, of course. So draw a heart at an angle, and I'll just put in a little detail right there to make it look like it's an opening. So just draw a heart over here, and another little curve inside. There. And for our roof right here, if you want to add some details, and just add some shingles. So just add a big curve. And I'm just gonna start to stagger my curves. Or you can make them straight however you like. One more layer. And same thing, just finish it off at the bottom. There. And of course, we need to add a flag right here at the top. I'm gonna go up, a little pull, and then a flag that swings out and connects right there. Okay, so now we have this part. I thought it'd be really cool in this area. Let's draw one of those big tunnel slides. So I'll say about right here. I'm gonna start and I'm gonna bring a line across and I'm gonna curve it down towards this area like a big macaroni. And about right here, I'm gonna stop. And in this area right here, I'm going to draw kind of this oval shape oval circle for the opening. And then let's come about right here and I'm just going to follow my curve and come right back up. There. Super fun, right? And so then let's draw some details. I'm just going to add some curves right here to make it look round. And one more right here. And they usually have those um, sections, right, in this area right here. So I'll go ahead and thicken it up. There. 
Okay, so now we have our slide in. Um, let's come next to it and we're going to draw another one of these. So I'm going to come right across, so say about right here. I'll just give myself a point and from there I'm going to draw the exact same thing as here. Maybe a little bit smaller, we'll see. So I'm going to find my center about right here, just like the other side, and connect. So I'm quickly going to do the same thing, just like the other side. Just come straight down. Can't wait to see your fan art of your playground. And of course, after you draw this playground, you can add in all the Draw So Cute characters to make it extra cute. And connect. Add a flag. You can make a rainbow flag or add whatever you like. And once again, same thing. I'm just going to add some of these shingles. Do that quickly. Okay, so then once again, we're going to break it up, right? About the same area, just like the other one. Go straight across, and let's add, I'm making this thicker right here, and I'm going to add some uh, railing. So let's come about right here for an opening. Two straight lines, and I'm going to come right across. Cut it off, and then for some details, Oh, let's see here. Um, <laughs> okay, this way. So same thing. There. And then, um, can add another ladder here. We're going to go up. I mean, we're going to come down with an angle, sorry. And same thing. But let's make this one a rock wall. So if you want to do that, let's come in here and just kind of draw in these wobbly shapes here and there. It's all up to you. Just draw these shapes first. And of course, we're going to have to have a heart one right here. <laughs> And maybe a circle, something, anything. And then in the center, just put a little dot. Like that. And then we're going to go right across. With some lines there to hopefully make it look like a rock wall. And then let's see here. And I thought it'd be really cute. We could add some lights if you like. So I'm just going to come right here and draw some curves across and then add some lights. Now that we're done with this section right here, we definitely have to connect it somehow, right? So I thought it'd be really cute if we added one of those little wobbly bridges. So right here, I'm going to go ahead and connect it. A slight curve, and I'll thicken it up. Put some lines in here for indication of the boards. And then let's come to the top of our right here and draw another curve. And then, um, can thicken this up as well and then we're going to add some lines coming straight down mm 
there. Okay, so now that we have we're connected, let's come over here. We're gonna have to uh, draw some swings, of course. So I'm gonna come, say about right here, nice and high. I'm gonna go right across, about this much, and thicken this up. So this is a top beam, and then we're gonna draw the legs of our swing. So come down, of an angle towards the same area. Thicken it up. There. And then we're going to draw another one tucked in the back. A slight angle, a little bit higher up. And connect right there. So now we have a nice stable swing. We can add two swings in here. So I'll come about right here. Come straight down. And here. Just want to make sure I get my swings in. There. And then I'm going to add seat. Just a simple seat. Just draw a little curve. And thicken it up. So same thing here. And then you can come back up here for some details if you like. Just where the swings hinge up to the top. And um, that is pretty much it, I think, for this amazing playground set. So let's spruce it up some more and uh, let's add some grass here and there. May add a tree. So let's add some bushes right here. Just a line. Just to give it some details, you can add a tree, let's say about right here. Just to spruce it up. Add a very simple tree, really fast here. And cut it off, and then come right here. And just wobble a bunch of curves around. I'm going off the page, <laughs> but hopefully you get the idea. And so, same thing on this side. Make sure I'm kind of straight across. And once again, same things. Add another tree. And look at my camera, make sure I'm not going off too much. And oh my goodness, that's a weird shaped tree. <laughs> okay, hopefully you get the idea. Here, I'm going to fix my tree. <laughs> I was so, so concerned about not going off of the page. So they're all done. I really hope you love how this magical playground set here turned out and I've inspired you to draw it as well. And of course, I've made it fun and easy for you to follow along. Thanks so much for watching and if you've loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw videos. See you later.